Virgin Galactic is down 19% today as of January 13th. And today is definitely a day where the Virgin Galactic investors are feeling the heat. So let's see what has happened. If you look at the chart right now, in just one day, they are down 19%. Looking at their six month chart, they are down about 70%. And looking at their one year chart, this stock has been down 69%, almost 70%. If we zoom out and take a look at it, this stock, when it was supposed to IPO, they were trading about $10.18. So basically today they have hit the lowest even before opening into the market for trading. They had few bumps along the road. They went up to $33 in February 21st, 2020. They went to $54 February 2021 with about an after an year. They went all the way back to $44 in June, July 2021. This is what we will talk about in today's video. We'll take a look at their price chart. We'll take a look at what are the reasonings why the stock is down so much and what am I doing with this particular stock? So if that is something you're interested in, keep watching and let's get this started. If you are watching this video up to this point and you are a Virgin Galactic investor, well, first and foremost, I would recommend that do not worry about the current stock price. So Virgin Galactic stock price fell today because they announced that they will add up to $500 million in debt from the sale of 2027 convertible senior notes through a private offering. And the reason the company intends to use the net proceeds from the offering to fund working capital, general and administrative matters and capital expenditures to accelerate the development of its spacecraft fleet. Now, if you remember that when we did the test flight of Richard and the stock price went up to about $44, $45 range. And then we had few other test flights planned. All of them got delayed because of many reasons. So going into further details, so Virgin Galactic will raise $425 million from the sale of the 2027 convertible senior notes through a private offering with an additional $75 million option also expected to be granted to buyers. We all understand what precarious situation Virgin Galactic is in. And this is also very concerning for the shareholders because if you have been owning Virgin Galactic for a while now, your shareholder equity will also get diluted as they add more debt to the company and issue more shares. Current plan for Virgin Galactic's commercial flight is about late 2022, which is this year. However, as we have seen, the delays have happened so many times for the test flights, it would not be surprising that this flight gets delayed again. So what can you do? In my personal opinion, the market has overreacted on this news because we understand that in order to fund the operations, Virgin Galactic needs to build a war chest. And that's exactly what they are doing. In order to build the next spacecraft and have a commercial space flight ready for 2022 or even 2023, you need money. And that's exactly what Virgin Galactic is doing. Most of the growth companies, when they are in this phase, they need to generate a lot of cash in order to fund the operation and bring to a level where they can start generating revenue. At some point of time, they can generate enough revenue that they outpace the expenses. And that is what we call break even and getting into the profit zone territory. As a disclaimer, this is not a recommendation to buy, hold or sell Virgin Galactic. Please do your own due diligence before you invest your hard earned money. However, as a short term investor or a trader, you can take advantage and that's exactly what I'm doing today. So what I did today was I bought 100 shares of Virgin Galactic at $10 and five cents and I sold a covered call for April 14th at the current strike price of $10 for $1.85, which is $185. That means that my cost basis for Virgin Galactic is $8.20 and selling it at $10. If my shares gets called away, I would be generating about 18% return on this trade in just less than three months. So this is one way that you can take advantage of downturns like this to your advantage. However, please note that there is a risk involved when you play options like this. Now, here's a word of caution before you even adopt this strategy. Now, if you are not familiar with options, option strategy, I would not recommend going with this option. This is just an example I wanted to share with you all. The next is you have to think from a risk standpoint. How much risk are you willing to take for this trade? Because this trade is a risky. Virgin Galactic as an underlying asset is a very risky asset. So that should not be the majority of your portfolio. Your portfolio should always be focused on good quality stocks. And then maybe you can have some play money which you do not mind losing in case something goes south. And options are always risky. So 
always do your own due diligence. Do you think the market overreacted to this news for Virgin Galactic? Let me know in the comment section below. That's all I have for you today. If you found any value in today's content, don't forget to hit the like, click on subscribe and ring the bell notification. I will see you next time, Investor Family. But don't forget to invest for tomorrow.